Hey everybody, welcome back to my page, Hot Mess Express Tutorials. If this is your first video, then we're just figuring this out one video at a time. If you have come back to watch more of my videos, then thank you so much. We're actually getting back to real makeup tutorials, me figuring out what I'm actually doing because I'm still, I still don't know. Hopefully this turned out good enough. Uh, today we're working on some cut creases. This is sunflower themed for me. She says that it looks like a bird a little bit at one point, maybe still. <laughs> this video also is going to be a voiceover because we had a really cool photographer on set taking pictures while we were doing the videoing. So that's why we did it. To make sure that we didn't hear the clicking sound every five seconds we made a voice over so hopefully I explain this well enough you know my explanations are always top-notch really excited to be doing a makeup tutorial again I feel like it's been a really long time since I've done an actual tutorial let's get started in three two one hashtag fresh face okay so I really 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 hope that I don't sound like an idiot like I did in my last voiceover so we're starting with the urban decay Okay, we're done with that. So now we're on to Morphe and I'm gonna put a cream shadow over top of that to set that. And that looks like a mess. We'll just Vogue it out. And I'm gonna drop that. I have a real bad case of the dropsies like all the time. We're gonna go in with this teal color and this is a Juvia's Place palette. So you can see the pigment is building up. They have crazy pigment, you see that? Now we're gonna put like a glittery teal over top. It's a little bit more blue when you don't have that teal color in the background. So I'm just gonna like put that on for five minutes, but it's edited out, so don't worry. Wow. Okay, this is Kat Von D Concealer. And it starts off really nice, really in a good, nice line. And then I do that, that little trick where you look up and maybe that's where my real crease is, but I decide to do something like this. Wow. And what is this part of my recording? Oh, guess what? Um, that's a shape you didn't get to see me make. So we're just gonna set that concealer once again, then we're gonna use this pigment, which looks very different. It's like orange, but it has, oh, okay, we're moving forward. Well, it has like some pink shimmer on top, and then I'm gonna put some brown in the outer corner just to build some dimension. I wish that I put some more dimension in the cut crease part from like, I guess, where I'm making my new lid. Um, now we're gonna use the bright ass yellow. That's my daisy. Yep. And you think this is broken and bent, but it's supposed to be like that actually. Then I'm gonna, ha, huh, this is fake. Um, I'm gonna go in with this gold color, which is, this is the most that I've, wow, did you just hear that? My fingers crack. That's the most I've ever concentrated on my makeup. So I put some tape down on here. Also, I'm using some Jeffree Star liquid lipstick. I apparently forgot to show that. And I go to take it off and it didn't actually work. So I just went and did it myself. All right, now what am I thinking about? Oh, okay, I'm gonna do my brows in Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow. My brows are so small, so I fixed it. Ready, see? And what's next? Oh, okay, I'm gonna do that. And then put some blue on the bottom, so blue on the top, and then blue on your your uh, tear duct, that area, is that correct? That's so nice looking. Also my first time using that. All right, and now my face was like super, super moist. This is a Farsali primer that looks like lotion, right? And I'm gonna rub it into my face, all over my face and prime my face. And I'm gonna use Maybelline. This is the full foundation. Um, and I'm using one of those felt, I think that's what it was called, um, beauty blenders. And just look how much, I, I barely put any on my face and it 
can go all over my face. And I'm just gonna keep going. Oh, Whew, that was a close one. Oh, more dripped. Uh, and none in my hair. Cut my life into pieces. What? No, I got it on my shirt. All right, well now I'm just gonna be sad and rub it into my neck. Oh, and we're happy again, but not really. And that pink color wakes me up. I'm going back in with the Kat Von D for the regular concealer all over my face. That was some ASMR for you guys. And the cheek braid, which, ooh, I really have the dropsies every day, which is just my day one um, bronzer. There we go, more things just falling out of my life. So here's some blush. I put some on my nose because I feel like it makes me look younger. And this is just gonna be shown for a wrinkle in time. And lipstick is going on my lips. That's Huda Beauty and I don't remember actually, but I'll put it in the, the description down below. Oh my gosh, I'm wearing lip gloss. I'm really becoming a new person this year. All right, let's set this and get this over with, thanks. <laughs> Here is a Mary Kay mascara. Make sure that you go to the description down below and the link for my mom's information to buy it from her will be there. Here's some lashes to make this more dramatic. Perfect. Here are my social medias. Follow me there. This is the look. I hope that you like it. And my Hamas Express tip of the day is to never leave your purse in your car, even if it's locked. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.